Hello guys, my name is Tara from Tara Arts Tutorial and today I'm gonna be teaching you how to change your desktop background in Windows 7. Alright, so the first way to do that, of course, you will have to have a pictures and then let's say this one is gonna be your desktop background, all you gonna do is right click on it and then set as desktop background and there you go, your desktop background is already changed to that picture and the second way is actually easier so you just right click in uh, anywhere in this desktop and then right click and then go to personalize and then choose whatever that you want to add as background let's say a uh, landscape here and after that weird sound <laughs> actually it's beautiful sound you will get your background but let's say you don't want this background and as you can see here this landscape it's actually uh, there's a couple of uh, landscapes here so how to choose one of them so after you double click it now you can go down here and double click there and then look at that so much to choose and let's say you're gonna wanna choose this one just check this and save change and then let's say you're gonna choose this one just choose it and save change and it already changed and then let's say uh, you're gonna choose um, this one double click it and it already changed alright and by the way you can go here get more themes online you can click that and you can download some of um, themes from online from Windows uh, from Microsoft website like here like here Harry Potter and Avatar I downloaded from the website and yes you can actually uh, set, this as, set this as desktop background and just clear all and choose one that you desire to be your desktop background save change alright guys so that is how to change your desktop background in Windows 7 maybe some of you have some a problem well particularly if you just uh, change from XP to Windows 7 and you can confuse how to change your desktop background well that's how you to do it alright guys my name is Tara from Tara Arts Tutorial if you find this if you find this useful please subscribe to my channel and look for another cool tutorial bye